Hi, I'm Dr. Trevor Matthews. I'm here today to give you a quick overview on how to do body mass index calculations or BMI calculations. It's a very quick and easy thing to do and it's done all the time in order to get an idea of what someone's body weight status is. So in other words, are they underweight, are they overweight, are they normal weight, obese, um, any of those sorts of classifications. So let's go ahead and get to an example question here. So Cody is 195 pounds. He's five foot six inches tall. Um, so what is his BMI and also what is his weight classification? So first we need to get these units to so the 195 pounds and the five foot six inches tall. We need to get those from English units to metric units. Um, so we're gonna go from 195 pounds, we're gonna divide that by 2.2 .2 and get 88.63 kilograms. For the height, we're gonna go five foot, multiply that by 12 to get that into inches and then add in the six because it's five foot six and that's gonna give us 66 inches. And from the 66 inches, I do this in two stages because it's just what I find easy. Um, so I do 66 times 2.54 to get 167.64 centimeters, but I need to get this into meters. Um, and then so I, what I do from there is I just take the centimeters, divide that by 100, so I end up with 1.6764 meters. Um, and then the BMI calculation is very straightforward. You take the body mass in kilograms and you divide that by the square of the height in meters, so that is 88.63 divided by 1.6764 squared. Um, and don't forget, order of operations, you need to do the squaring first, so you need to first multiply 1.6764 by itself, and then you can use whatever you get from that and uh, divide it into the 88.63. So 88.63 divided by 1.6764 meters squared and that's going to give you 31.5 kilograms per meter squared which is their BMI so that is the unit for BMI so his so Cody's BMI is 31.5 so let's go from the 31.5 and figure out what that is in his for his weight classification and you can find charts like this one here all over the internet so this is just a simple BMI classification chart and you can see that we have underweight we have normal weight we have overweight and obesity class one, obesity class two, and obesity class three. And you can see the BMI classifications for that. So Cody's BMI, if we go back, was 31.5. So if we look here, 31.5 is going to make him in obesity class one. So he is obese based on his BMI, which is the primary way that we assess for obesity classification or underweight classification because it's simple, it's quick, it's easy to do, um, it's cheap, uh, it's something that pretty much anyone can do with very uh, limited equipment. And so this is just the way most clinicians and most researchers are going to be classifying people in their um, respective weight classes. So BMI is super easy to do and I hope this video was helpful, but please come back and watch another video. Thanks.